This is Exhibition Road. Further down the road is Imperial College Road. And right now we're heading towards the uh, National Science Museum, which is, which is basically also at the Natural History Museum. Um, it's about 1.40 now. We woke up about, well I woke up about 12ish. And then we spent all morning trying to figure out today's plan because different tickets were booked. We couldn't move on Monday night tickets and stuff like that. Even now we still haven't figured it out. Welcome to the Science Museum. We just scanned our tickets. By the way, this is just future me telling me why all this is fast forwarded because the original video was almost two hours long, so I had to edit it so it's less than an hour. I've kept all the audio so in case I want to listen to what I said, I can still slow it down and listen to it. Yeah, so hopefully it's not annoying. That's stage one. Stage zero. Probably a bit, I guess, into orbit. It's the black fucking arrow. So, and there's the fucking bearings. The bearings are locked. It's the fucking V2 engine. V2 engine, 1944. This is the real Soyuz rocket, the Soyuz craft that they, that they sent to the International Space Station. 2016 Tim Peake and Tim Cockler before this was prototyped. Just look how black it was. Oh, oh my god, this is so... And there's the parachute. Soho spacecraft launched by the ESA. Space Lab 2, Chase! Oh my god, they use that in the Space Lab. Space Lab was the upper stage of the Saturn V rocket. This is on the reconnaissance orbiter. It's still orbiting Mars to this fucking day. 
This is the high rise board that they use for the football family. But it's big old too. Launched by the ESA December 2003. Oh, wait, there's a. Oh. Fucking wow. Yeah, this, uh, this is definitely dead by now. Oh my god. This is on the Hubble telescope. Launched in 2002. We've already got the images from the new Horizon spacecraft, which is a Pluto. But we've not updated this. Titan is a place worth exploring. The Cassini spacecraft, we've already seen images from this. Again, they haven't updated this thing. And also, my favorite is, is probably my no, maybe no, I can't say what my favorite is, it's just too amazing. But this thing, it, there's no label on it, but it looks identical to the Hubble telescope. This is definitely a replica of the Hubble telescope. <coughs> but the Hubble telescope is way bigger than this. This is not this is not one to one size. The Hubble telescope is way bigger than this, probably at least five, ten, five, seven, eight times bigger. That's a fragment. Oh my God. That's a fragment of the Skylab space station. In 1979. Wow. This is back when we have to rely on Russians to launch us on their same spacecraft and wear their spacesuits. Wrap the cut the loony fucking man. This is a lunar seismometer to record um, seismic activity in the moon. RCS thrusters to help control descent. This monitor heart breathing rate is all of that when you go in space a because you're in point zero G. I mean, there's another mistake here because you see the space shuttle, Discovery space shuttle, flying upright over the Earth. If it was in orbit, it would be up there. But it's clearly not in orbit because it still has the orange tank on. And if you saw the orange tank, it should be upside down. The top half of the space shuttle should be facing towards the Earth. Yeah. Yeah. Holy fuck, this thing's still on the moon now. So, so we can make it like distances where the moon can be accurately recorded. This is an older, this is an older replica, I'm pretty sure, because before they wouldn't have these massive spaces between the corners. Because they would have one of those fold up lunar landers, a lot of lunar rovers that'd be stored over there. Space oh my god, they put, they put Buzz Aldrin's name on it. I've come back to look at Black Arrow, but it's just fucking amazing. This is the Scout launch vehicle launch satellite. 
it costs fucking loads and look how tiny this fucking thing is. Like now, how far we've gone. So, but I've, I've come back to the GTA engine, it's just too fucking amazing for us. All the fuel and the ground and around the corner. We have the turbo pumps over there. Um, I'm not sure if there's some gimbal, the big gimbal then. Up there is where the main fuel comes from. And it's also where it gimbals it. I'm not sure if this one does gimbal, because not all the engines gimbal. Before we have orbital telescopes and space telescopes, 1785, 40 foot telescope. This is the original mirror that I used for time. Look up, look, it's very freaking freaking. I mean, look how smooth it had to be. You had to use it for a green telescope. Oh. Royal Mail, Royal Mail. Between 1820 and 1880. Uh, London Royal Mail. in the x-ray diffraction machine. I don't hear the missing one. Speed runner boat, fucking diabolical. This thing was fast and yet fast as shit and they had fucking baskets for seats. Rolls-Royce motor engine was revolutionary, just as the SpaceX motor engine was. Um, Rolls-Royce are still getting bits today, man. There's constant development. They even in get into the fucking aerospace business now, and they're smashing it. Well, not smashing it, but they're making big movements in here as well. Oh, oh shit, they couldn't fit the cone on. So they took the cone off from the top. These are actual remnants of things from Hiroshima. Oh my god. And these sand from the front bomb test. Is it Not only is this ball all just fucked, but it's hard to fucking eat. Hiroshima ball. Oh my god. Look at this shit, man. It's fused together, like fully. Yeah. 
Oh my god, I thought well, this is it, this space is it. We got even more coming by. Uh, not by. Um, guys, Hollow 10. This is virtually identical to the one in Hollow 10. So they almost like the new of Hollow 10. It's a test flight to see if everything works. It got really close to the moon, but. And then they would be sitting and sent back. I never thought I'd see this for like another 10 years or something. Fucking amazing. Let's see the back of this. Ma, There were supposed to be freeze um, transgenic mice that they did work on. But they took it away, they thought about it. Yo, are you just, okay, wow, so, this is, wait, this isn't a fucking iron dress, though. No, you fucking know. Heading downstairs to floor minus one, where living stuff is, I'm not going to spend too long here. Secret life of a who was down here, basement. Oh. The basement. I'm gonna go to the garden. Oh. This shit might be actually boring, actually. I'm not gonna lie. Well, not boring is maybe not interesting. Oh, it's a play area. Why the fuck you come to one of the, the biggest things in the fucking world to see? I didn't come to a fucking garden. There's to be more down here, right? Oh, the secret life of a home. That's what I want to do to I've, I've fully lost Christian and Adam by now. I, I have no fucking idea where they are. Now all we're doing is cold here, hot here, inside the refrigerator outside. The skin is thing. Oh my god, how much way do I have to spin it? I don't know. Right, clearly, minus one floor was a bit boring. So now, since I've only got about half an hour, maybe 40 minutes here, I push. I'm gonna go to things I wanna see, because clearly it's a lot of boring things. So I'm gonna go to second floor, no, the first floor, to see the information technology bit. Communications. 
and then go to the third floor or whatever floor that is where the fly zone is. We get to see how fly works. Get to see what the controls are, where the fuel goes, and see how fly actually works. That's where I want to go. So I'm gonna head there now. Right, I'm here. Information age is over there. Our mathematics gallery is over here. Honestly, if there's anything interesting in mathematics gallery, probably not. But oh wow. Wow. Oh, 56 Lincoln Fields, London, winning door. Oh, so this used to be similar to a door, that place. All right, I'm gonna head to the um, information ATM. Right, I'm gonna head to the thing you know, to the information section. We can have a quick spin there. Right, I said I was gonna head there now. Yeah, I saw this. Wow. I can't. I have time. I just filmed this time. It's just here. I don't know what it is. I don't have time. I'm gonna over to the information bit now. I honestly don't have time. I know, I know. I said I was gonna be quick. The last one. Science City. Let's see how London developed scientifically from the 1500s to the 1800s. Oh shit, park makers of London. I got a feeling we're gonna see some clocks. Grandfather. Oh, yep, grandfather clocks. Oh. oh my god. It's Eddie Munson. It's Eddie Munson. So you guys will make things like they used to. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so many bloody grandfather clocks. Oh no. Right, I don't even have time for this. I gotta. Go into the um, communications bit. Hopefully that's interesting. Wow, look at this. I'm standing over the edge, almost dropped my phone. Scared to drop my phone even. Currently in the elevator, going to the third and final floor towards the flight fly zone in Wonder Lab. And there's a shake bar, which is cheap, I might get something because I'm fucking thirsty. Oh, I'm going on to ground B. Someone's. Alright, in a moment. See you. Wow. Age of flight. I kind of want to go to Russia just to go into the abandoned Baran warehouse just to see the Baran. Shit, you can't see anything flashing at night. So, but this is what they copy and you see it like. Rolls Royce Aero engine. 
Look at this one. I wouldn't dare stay this close to an engine. Unless it's this. This is some final destination shit, man. It just turns on somehow automatically. It sucks me in and I fucking get cut into pieces. Jesus, it's fucking amazing. Wow, look at this plane here. The jet. You know, if the end, if the plane needs to leak fuel, it can leak it. I can't remember. I'm pretty sure it's in the wing somewhere. Here is the plane. You know, the, I'm pretty sure that's a Nazi plane. And over here. RAF helicopter. Inside. Another plane over here. Right, I just got a call from Adam and Christian saying I better hurry the fuck up. Um, well, they didn't actually say that, but yeah, I'm finishing off. There's just still a few planes I haven't looked in depth, but I guess I've seen them. So that's, that's all I need to do. Heading over to the last section of four, floor three, which is the fly zone, and where the gallery is. So I want to have a look at that. Here's the reflections mirror for photos. I'll take one. Welcome to the information age. Train signaling instrument. Making and breaking security message. Oh yeah, most codes. Oh, it puts what I sent in. Oh. Phone repairs, sound downloading, and a call song. Those phones as well, they're cell phones. I don't even know how these things are. Oh, cables. Oh my god, I love looking at cables. Wow. Right, I'm done with the whole museum, so back down the stairs. Um, I'm gonna take a few selfies with the rocket engines because I never thought I'd see a J2 engine in real life ever, unless I went to Florida. So I'm gonna take some selfies with that. Maybe something else that's real. I don't wanna take, I really, I don't wanna take something that, that's fake. So I'll take some pictures with the J2 engines. I just took that shot because you could see the shrouds over the actual um, plumbing of the engine itself and I'm just thinking like because of the recent design changes that, 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 that we're just considering on Starship which was to completely remove the shrouds and make all the plumbing heat proof anyways so that it could save a lot of weight and I just wanted to see shrouds because that just got me interested in shrouds all right yeah and now I'm coming out to find Christian and Adam which somehow I finished the bloody museum before me, even though I was being fast as fuck. I was speeding through everything, as you can see in the videos. But yeah, they still managed to finish it before me, which don't make sense. Oh, 
Oh my god, they're over there. The fuckers. How the fuck did you guys finish so? Natural History Museum. Fossil tortoise. Fool's gold. Flowing minerals. Oh, what? Look, one's from England, one's from New Jersey. Whoa. That's it! That's so cool. Jade minerals. It's an amethyst geo. But age of fishes. Fossils of fishes from years ago in England. So now this has been crystallized with copper. You know what this reminds me of, Adam? Adam, do you know what this reminds me of? And if you separate water and lava far enough apart, you get cobblestone. Evacuation, evacuation sites for earthquakes and earthquake prone zones. Oh look! Look, it's Oscar! Well not now, tube worms. Underwater vents. Oh, wait. I thought I said a kid then, but this is a kid now. Oh, wait, it's, 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 it's called a kid now. Yeah, a kid now. Oh, it's a kid now. It's, it's, like, it's in a kid now. But why is it not red? Why has it not got big knuckles and why is it not red? Some reason the hedgehog's not blue. New rock. And used to roam the lands of South America and South Africa. Wow. <laughs> we both just looked that disappointed. <laughs> a barrel. <laughs> I was trying to gaslight you, but you're just too scared. Gaslight me that. Run it. It's a guy who can't for 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 Wait, is this a natural remains? I mean, it's not. I mean, there you go. Or there. Super Go forwards. We're in a supermarket. Oh, yeah, you can see oh, 
400,000 versus 200,000. Yeah. I told everyone this story in geography. 63% versus 37%. Have you been there? I don't know. Oh, no. Shit, I thought. What's the point of it? It's actually cold. Oh, it actually is cold, yeah. But it's like the cotton must melt. Oh, yeah. Another year, another layer. Right, go. Whoa. There's four loads of balls. Are these, are these are rocks on these? Okay, four. Oh. It's the bloody carbon cycle. I don't even know what is this changing into. I'm so confused. Oh, cells. This one looks more clear. Cells, something, eyes, beef, grass, shells, something. Uh, measuring time. Earth's future. Earth now. Earth's past. What does red mean? Uh, that's a map. Maybe. This size map. Does it? Yes, absolutely. 100%. Where is Adam? Life moving on to land. And oh, yeah, recent, some, loads of dinosaurs, we actually know now that like, they have feathers. Cool. And some sort of fur. Yeah. Keep it then, like, we'll yeah. kill you. Look at that. It's a gigantic crocodile. Wait, you can see schools. These human ones. Over there. There's one there. That's over there, yeah. Wow. Mammoth. Hot build, cool build, cool build. This is the beginning. What's that one? Oh. Adam, what are you doing over there for? I'm extracting, I don't know when, pots and whatever. That's today. Oh look, no, there's none of them today. But a million years ago there was Neanderthals. Heisenberg, that doesn't have to Heisenberg. Fidel Bergerosis, Annie Tessa, Laurentius, whatever. And then right at the bottom is that little thing. And then Homo sapiens. All this coming in Cana. Mm. Homo sapiens child. What, this is meant to look like one of our kids. Well, my kids. This is an adult woman of a Neanderthal. And there's the school of her. And then this is. Whoa, wow, he's. The Heisenberg head looked massive. Their heads are massive. 
This looks more like a human tooth than that one over there. No. This one. This is like a I've got a cousin that looks like this. No, I swear to you. When we're erectus, I don't mind reconstruction. No one living right now. Look at that. Adam, do you know all the names of each um of each disc in the spine? No. Do they have all individual names? This is Cheddar Man. And this is Cheddar Man now. Oh, this looks so fucking real. I can't believe you bought a stone. What? You just bought a little rock. Two pounds. Oh my god, look at those. Well, I mean, we've seen real swans. Let's go towards Dippy. Are you recording? I am recording. I can't believe you bought a rock. What do you mean? Oh, I started it, it when I was It's little, so awkward. So just... When you go to like the thing, oh, I want to buy a rock, please. <laughs> oh my god. We've got a full collection of all birds and birds' heads and stuff. Yeah. So cool. Oh, Adam, remember when we pinned down the things? Oh. Do you remember? Yeah. When we had to do it ourselves? What, would, what did we pin down? Um, locusts. Um, oh, yeah. It was like a wrap. Oh, my God. This is so amazing. Wow. Look at this massive chicken foot. Oh, you know what? I'll show you later. Wow. Holy oh, moly. Whoa, look at that email. Adam, it's your relative. Look at this resplendent. Resplendent. Resplendent quetzal. Look at the pigeon. Adam, pigeon. Finally, a pigeon you can catch. Foot and breath. Okay, you catch it through the. And then you got the massive emu. It's a penguin. It's a penguin. A penguin. Wait, penguin. Why are that I told you flamingos. Flamingos. Isn't it fake colours? Fake colours. Whoa, this one looks scary. This one looks proper scary, you know. These dodos? No, 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 there's not. No, this is a dodo. Ah, okay. Yeah, this is a dodo. This one looks like a pinky. I can't believe people kept dodos as like pets. But now I've seen one in real life, it's kind of scary. Eagles. I like eagles. Eagles are cute. Look at the wings on this motherfucker. Oh my god. Alright, let's go towards the dinosaur. Oh my god. Look at that. What is this? Sink animal. No, I've not got Welcome. This is Dippy. Let me get a closer. Oh. I'm so glad I asked if we just take 30 seconds just to take a picture of that. Oh, just a minute. Oh, look at that. T Rex. Oh no, it's just, just T Rex themed. Creepy coral. Is that is this the only thing we've got left? I think this is the only Oi! Mouth. Oh my god, I'm actually scared. Is there bugs on there?
Typical kitchen box. Extra protein. Ugh, fucking spider. Uh, is that book in there? Oh. What? What in there? What in the Christ? Arachnids. I hate arachnids. I hate them. Swarming fucking insects. Mm -hmm. I hate insects, mm -hmm. man. They look disgusting. Boom. Mm. Oi, where's this food? Sandwich. Fly. Whoa. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. It's time to go, boy. Wow. It's just looking at This is the thing from Madagascar. Adam. Oh. Scott kicked out the Natural History Museum. Stayed in there. Shit, I didn't even start recording. Oh shit, we just got kicked out the Natural History Museum. We stayed in there 54 minutes to. When it closes at 5.50. And there's a Facebook um, ice cream truck. You think he was staring at you? Who was staring at Because I... <laughs> I thought it was just the driver in, yeah? yeah? So I was looking at the prices and I'm like, you have lost your mind. And then I clocked there was someone standing <laughs> there. Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Wow, we just got off the train without Christian this time. I'll explain you in a bit. Um, this is a life size monopoly. We're not going here, but it's fucking awesome. But it's basically so expensive. Life size monopoly. There's a leaderboard of the best players. But now we're heading to the pizza place. Oh, how much does this stuff cost? Mm. It's kind of regular price. Yeah. That is, yeah. Right. On to the pizza place. Right, so basically why Christian couldn't come is that he doesn't have enough money because today we're planning to do the museums and then we're planning to go to the pizza place and then to a karaoke place straight after because by the time um, pizza place would be like our dinner and then karaoke place would be like our night out and then we still have time to go on a late night walk or whatever. Um, but he doesn't have enough money. We tried for like, how long, like 20, 30 minutes. Half an hour, yeah. Yeah. Like yeah. Um, to try and find ways to either get to 
that was a homeless guy. That was a homeless guy. Um, to make him money, or to either save him enough money so that he can get get to the places that we're going to. But um, nah, he can't go to any of them. So it's just been it's just being Adam. Yeah. <laughs> um, so there was a pizza place, and tomorrow. Um, I don't know what he's going to do for food because he said he needs food because he said he needs money to get trains and stuff to work. So you, it's a bit of a sticky situation. Welcome to the cheapest pizza place <laughs> in all of London. The People's Pizza. It's actually very nice. Alright, we just ordered our pizzas. What did you get, Adam? Uh, Festa carne. It's like, what's that? It's like, did you get this ham? Yeah. Oh, they have a star in it. Turkey ham. Turkey ham. Um, pepperoni and chicken. And mozzarella. And mozzarella. And then I got a di diavolo, whatever it was called. It had chicken, mushrooms and jalapenos and mozzarella. And now we're waiting, we're waiting for things to look buzz. It's well nice. You also get apps and you get offers like 50% off and stuff. Imagine 50% off in our pieces. That'd be like Wait, I did already take a picture. Pizza. I just went to Sainsbury's locals in Tesco Express just to find out they're all flipping closed. So we're gonna go somewhere else after to get the drink. We've just come out of the pizza place. It was delicious by the way. And we're going towards the train station on the way with Sainsbury's. So I stopped by and bought some milk and some sparkling water, two litres each. <coughs> And then halfway through, Adam really needed the toilet, so we looked for a place. And then we thought of Starbucks, but then he wanted to buy something in Starbucks because you have to be a customer to be able to use the toilet. So he bought a chocolate straw, and he's been in the toilet for nearly like 10 minutes now. And I'm a bit worried, he's been ages and he's still not come out. Jesus. Adam just got out of the toilet, we just left Starbucks. <laughs> He was in there for a whole 15 minutes. Two people were waiting outside the toilet. He was so desperate to go, he bought a one pound ch ch cookie chocolate straw, straw cookie, cookie straw thing. <laughs> oh my fucking God, man. Now we're heading towards, we're going past Chinatown and Soho, no Soho then Chinatown. And then, cause it's on the way to the train station. And then we're going back home and finding Christine. Chinatown. Wow. Running up the stairs is really funny. I just comprehended what you said. You literally said you're running. <laughs> um, kind of fun not having to use the gym. I like looking at them. That was fun. Do you know what I mean? It is. It makes you feel like you've got somewhere to go. Yo, it's the high for my set. Um, we just got off the train. Adam almost fell asleep on me. Well, luckily the train stopped. <laughs> I woke him up. Um, no, you actually got really close. <laughs> Did I? Yeah, you're like that. Well, if the train didn't stop, you might have actually fallen asleep. I don't even remember. And then we're going to the way out towards the museums because we live right next to them. Alright, we got back to the room two and a half hours ago. Um, I Adam went in first, buzzed the door, <laughs> and then the buzz scared Christian and woke him up. And then he went to get the door, 
um, while I went towards the the South Kensington Club to somehow try and bullshit my way to try and get Wi-Fi. Um, but then the guy saw me and he realised I couldn't afford the club, so I was like, yeah, you can't afford it. So I came back and then I buzzed and then I did a voice <laughs> to try and <laughs> confuse you. Um, and then Adam picked up the phone when I buzzed. And then you, you called out Christian and then you said, um, oh, there's some random guy on the phone. <laughs> Did Christian believe it at first? I don't know, did you believe that? Some random guy to sell rocks. You have to think just that, I feel like you did that. I think you like you did that. I tried half an hour. Still half asleep. Still half asleep. And then, when added, and then the door went open because it started buzzing. And then it started. I was it started buzzing out for 10 years. Do you hold, like were you holding it? Do you just press it down? Just oh, like no, press, you just press on it. Because when, when you hold it, like it can't go. Drill. It's it was like, just, just, yeah, and I couldn't open it. I think maybe you just press it once or something. Oh. I don't know, I was just making a tune. Yeah, were you? Because <laughs> I just heard you come to the drilling thing, and I was like, oh shit, there's someone on the other side of the door, I probably shouldn't open it. <laughs> yeah, it was, and then I tried I pushing it open, it wouldn't open. Oh. And then I came in, no, I know, before I came in, Chris, I didn't realise I couldn't get in, so he came over to open the door, but as he was going out, Christian pushed him just gently, but Adam went flight. He tapped him, and Adam went flying. And then I came in, and then after that, we kind of just put our stuff away, and then we started watching. Um, oh no! Then we showed Christian the video because he fell asleep, the VR video because he fell asleep, and then we had some nice laughs in that because Adam <laughs> Adam's noises. And then after that, me and Adam went through the Snapchat like our history and shit, and then he went to have a shower. And now I'm about to have a shower. That's today for you. My grapes are fermented. And now my fruit tastes like alcohol. It's basically just like red wine mixed with fruit now. It's 